How to use Stripe Connect. In this video, I'm going to tell you more about Stripe Connect and how you can use it for your business. Okay, so Stripe Connect is one of the products of Stripe, a popular financial service. And Connect is the specific product to handle multi-business um, relationships. Like if you have a business model with involving multiple parties, like maybe you are a marketplace or you are a serv service um, distributor or you are an SAAS, then the Stripe Connect may be the right solution for you. So what you can do with Stripe Connect is, let's take a look at the Stripe docs here. You can basically automate the routing of payments between multiple parties. Like if you have a set of customers and a set of other uh, businesses that are related to your business, you can connect them uh, directly with Stripe Connect. So the services will be best described with a flow chart. Okay, so let's take a look at the flow chart down here. Okay, so this is how Stripe Connect operates. Now, this is the flowchart of the processes of the payment. So this is the customer, and the customer is directly charged to through your platform, which is your business over here. Let's say the charge is 10 US dollars, right? And in the connected account, the 10 US dollars will be directed to the connected account where it will be automatically uh, allocated with uh, by Stripe to uh, cater for um, other businesses. Like if your customer has sent you a direct charge, you can automatically uh, take away some of the uh, payments that they have made and allocate it to other things and sending it out to another bank account. In this case, this might be your other businesses. So for example, you are having a marketplace uh, business, which is your business here, the platform. Okay, so the customer makes a 10 US dollars uh, payment. And what Stripe does is that it will allocate this $10 and take 0 0.59 application fee, which can be set by you. And this 0.59 USD, Stripe will get some of that, will get some of that, and you will get some of that. So for example, the realistic case here, if you are having a marketplace application is maybe this is your service charge bank account for your platform. And this is the actual merchant, which is subscribing to your uh, marketplace platform so that's how it works okay now I'm gonna show you how you can start uh, creating a stripe connect because I think that's the most uh, intuitive way to learn how to use it now the first thing and most important thing you need to do is click more here and search connect uh, it's somewhere around here but uh, if you haven't been able to find it just go to Google and type Stripe Connect. And the next thing you wanna do is add features to Stripe Connect like this one over here. We have two additional features that we can use for Stripe Connect. You can issue spending cards and automate uh, sales taxes. But in this case, I'm going to explain how you can use Stripe Connect with the payment service, which is the basic uh, payment and payout service. Now, the first thing you need to do is to complete your platform profile. We're going to go ahead and do it. Let's see. So let's say, for example, I'm having a an e-commerce product. Next. And this is to manage the relationship, to describe the relationship. So let's see. Uh, let's Let's randomly choose for the sake of tutorial. So as you can see, these questions are there for you to help configure your Stripe Connect. So previously, you need to choose um, the packages of the Stripe Connect, but 
on this newer version of Stripe, you can have it uh, automatically recommended for you so that you don't have to worry about uh, the different options. Let's just go ahead and continue. Let's fill in the CAPTCHA over here. Now, one thing to note is that uh, another thing that is important to understand on why we are being asked this question is that being a financial service, Stripe must uh, adhere to the best practices of the finances and to uh, manage the disputes and the uh, support. So uh, in the Stripe Connect uh, service, the disputes by the customer between the customer and the business can either be solved by you the platform or by stripe itself now in the case of the dispute solving by yourself you, meaning the platform then um, it is best used for businesses that are uh, maybe attracting lesser uh, savvy consumers like for example if you are having a marketplace business uh, with a b2c model like like amazon or shopify let's say for example you will be attracting customers that are from the general public which may or may not have the ability to uh, collect evidences or collect um data for them to stand up and to uh, do appeals and disputes and in that case you might want to step in as a platform to help solve their issues now as you can see here that's what i th this is what i'm talking about the fraud and dispute liability so um, usually you have to choose between these three uh, connect uh, types but in that case, since we've already uh, answered the questions provided by Stripe, we can uh, have our recommended uh, connect type to be displayed. Now, I'm, I believe it's after I've added the business details, but I'm not ready to do that as of now. I'm just going to explain to you uh, the differences. So the standard one is the most general purpose one. This is for the most of the multi-party uh, businesses. The express one is if you want to get started and take a look at the Connect app and uh, for the businesses that are, not, again, attracting lesser uh, savvy consumers. And the custom one is if you have a robust and in a very established engineering team for you to customize the whole uh, Stripe Connect uh, functionality so that you can have a perfectly integrated Stripe Connect to your website or service. In other case, uh, again, in, in this example, I'm telling you how to uh, use Stripe Connect with the Stripe payment uh, service, which is not necessarily a high effort uh, system to work to be working on so on the express one as you can see the uh, fraud and dispute liability is on the platform which is on you but on the standard one it is resolved by the user so i recommend the standard one for you uh, if your customers are savvy in disputes and fraud so for example if you are having a b2b a multi-party business mo model I mean being a business uh, that will require your user which is the business to uh, professionally adhere to law to the law and to solve the fraud and dispute themselves in that case you are good to go with the standard uh, package but if your customer is the general public let's take it to platform in the Express or custom uh, type now i'm going to show you around so the stripe connect will be uh, involving the uh, onboarding the onboarding of your uh, other businesses or and your uh, users your customers 
and uh, if you have created a connect then you can uh, link the payments link for you to set up uh, the payment method and the payout to the businesses okay so that is all from me for now